Black hole sun. Won't you come? <laughs> so is this named after the song or just happened to Probably. I, I, you can't confirm <clears throat> that, so. Super high gravity Russian Imperial Stout is brewed with 100% barley, zero added sugar. Black Hole Sun is a great song, and it's an all right beer. So, today we're actually doing Dimitri here on the Tapping Out Show. Dimitri used to be called the Black Hole Sun, that's actually from the Black Market Brewery out in Temecula, California. beers that I've ever had, and I think Matt's only had one of the other ones, but that even come close to this is a Russian Imperial Stout. One is the Three Floyds uh, Dark Lord, and that's 15%. Um, the other one is from the brewery out in Fullerton, California, and it's called Black Tuesday, and that's just like 20 plus. We like this brewery a lot. It's one of those things that when you find something that where most of the stuff is pretty stable, like we like Rogues, uh, Coronado, the pretty big staples in our fridges, but this is one of the very few that I almost think Matt's going to tap out. The concept behind us always saying tapping out is the fact that we're going to try to get each other not to be able to drink something, just based on taste alone. So, you ready? Yeah, I'm not uh, usually a big fan of Russian Imperial Stouts, just personally, so I mean, if you like them, they're, you know, that's awesome for you. Um, that's usually... You know, kind of how we came up with this is usually he would give me something like this, which is kind of this black, dark thing that looks like mud. And uh, usually that's, I mean, because I'll try a lot of different kind of crap beers just to see what it tastes like. And usually that's the one where I just, uh, you know, not my thing. Uh, but, you know, I'll definitely try this one again and, and see how it goes and let you guys know what I think. But I'm going to crack this open. Again, Dimitri, also known as Black Hole Sun. This is from the Black Market Brewery out in Temecula, California. It's almost like some chocolate milk <laughs> gone bad. <laughs> it's kind of what it looks like. But, uh, All right. You ready? Yeah, cheers. Cheers. Whoa. Wow. That's really strong. That's a lot of flavor right there. Um, like I said, <laughs> I'm not normally... Uh, something I would normally order, you know, it's just so thick for me, you know, but um, it's, it's actually, the taste is really good. It's got a good caramel kind of uh, multi, multi kind of taste. Uh, for me personally, it's just thick, um, but you can really tell it's got a lot of alcohol in it, you know, it's almost got the, you know, the vapors coming off and, you know, you can, you can almost uh, taste the alcohol. This is definitely uh, super strong and uh, because of the aging process and everything, uh, you know, involved in something like this, uh, you know, it's got a lot of alcohol in it and, um, you know, it's, for, it's the kind of person that likes, you know, a lot of alcohol, strong kind of drinks that have a lot of flavor. Uh, you know, this is something you want to try whether you like it or not. I mean, I've had this a few times and, <laughs> Uh, you know, I, 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 first time I kind of hated it. I don't mind it now. Like I said, it's a little thick for me, just kind of hard to choke down. But, um, you know, for this kind of alcohol, you know, it's, it's got good flavor to it, you know, and, uh, and, uh, on, on the website, it says no sugar added. So that's always good. Uh, you know, you know, you know a lot about alcohol not adding sugar. It's good for not getting hangovers. So, you know, something that's strong. Plus a lot of sugar, you know, is not always the best thing for you. So it's nice and strong, uh, thick, malty, and uh, you know, if you, you finish one of these boys, you should get some kind of buzz <laughs> off of it. Well, and I usually, like I said, we usually share it. This is roughly about, I want to say, between October and December is when they make this. this is the third one they've made. Um, it is a barrel aged stout in Russian Imperial. It is strong for what it is. It is to keep you warm. It's I like it. And we'll probably do some more Russian Imperials after that. And just for
for you viewers out there, if anybody has a Dark Lord or a Black Tuesday and they want us to try it, or if they want to come hang out with us and try it, or if the breweries want to send it to us, we will love to do a video on it. But until then, this is the Tapping Out Show. If you want to contact us, anything, ask questions, ask us to give stuff, try stuff, whatever, info at tappingoutshow.com. We're on every social media site, Twitter, Instagram, YouTube, Facebook, Tumblr. I can't think of any other ones at this point. No. But until then, drink up, enjoy, talk to you later.